doubles plus one addition. Students must master their doubles and the count on strategy before attempting this advanced strategy. Students will use their 10 frames and counters and their knowledge of doubles to help answer facts that are close to doubles. We will be using our knowledge of our doubles to work on facts that maybe we might not know, okay? But if we know our doubles, that can help us get to these other ones. We're gonna use the 10 frame chart as part of our memory tool to remember how to do this strategy, all right? So then when we don't have all this in front of us, we still can picture something in our mind, that maybe the doubles 10 frame and how all those counters and come back to our doubles and remember our strategy to get to the answer. So let's talk about doubles first, because that's what I want us to be on our mind. All of our doubles facts, the answer is always turns out to be? Equal. equal. E What's that E word? Not equal. E even. even. They always turn out to be even. Okay, so let's use that knowledge that we know. They're always, doubles facts are always even. And let's now think about doubles plus one. We have which fact? Four plus four, four, plus four equals eight. eight. And you told me it was even, right? Because they all have a partner. What if we added one and add it to uh, one of them? Now, what addition fact do we have? Five, five plus four. equals nine. Nice job, you're right. Five plus four equals nine. Equals nine. Okay. But I want you to look closely. Is there a doubles somewhere that we could kind of think about? No. Uh-huh, look, if we covered that last one up, very good. Cover up that last one. Oh, Cover it up. Because what was our doubles that was, that was close to that? Um, it was four plus four equals eight. Four plus four equals eight, right? And we added one more to one four, right? We added one more to one four. Uh-huh. What's eight plus one more? Nine. Nine, right? So when I added one more to the four to make five, I also added one more to the answer eight to make nine. nine. We had four plus four equals eight, and then we had four plus five equals nine. Oh, you see how those facts are really close to each other? So we added one to our add-in, that added one to our sum, right? We can use what we know, our doubles facts, to get to maybe some hard facts that maybe I don't know six plus seven off the top of my head, but I know six plus six equals 12. What I want you to think about is identifying which double you might use to get to the answer. So let's look at the cards that I have. See a little think bubble? Look at this one. Think about it in your head, don't call out yet. Just think about it in your head. Think about that. 5 plus 6. I don't know 5 plus 6, but I know 5 plus 5. What's 5 plus 5? 10. 10. So if I added one more to the 5, I add one more to the 10, what do I get? You get um, 11. What do I get? 11. What do I get? 11. What do I get? 11. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm.